but yeah, I can't sprint for very long because I'm carrying a whole bunch of stuff. That is, I imagine that so. Will need to be cons that will need to be considered later on. What just flew over us? Uh, those are harmless. Okay. New data uh, creature data sent to terminal. All right. Correct. All right, so that light bulb will definitely turn a profit. Yeah. So, yeah. Big screw, uh, worth 28. Soda can, worth 60. <laughs> 60? Yeah. That's almost as much as the apparatus that we got there. How is a, how is a can of soda more than a giant screw? I... You, like I said, you would be surprised. Ah. Uh, all right, then. Alright, so now that we have uh, gone back up into orbit, we now need to go to the company building in order to uh, sell off our profit. Alright then. So I'm guessing we're at the loading screen. Zero days left to meet profit quota. I mean, we got that light bulb. Yeah. Alright. Report to the company building to sell your scrap metal and other goods. You have two days left to meet the profit quota. You can use the terminal to route the autopilot to the company building. Oh. Okay. Alright, so, this is where we off-sell our, our crap. You just go up to this counter, you drop all this stuff here on the counter, and then you ring the bell. Uh, sometimes you gotta ring it multiple times until he answers. Go ahead, ring the bell. Meet the boss. Alright. It's to the right. Oh. Ring it a couple more times. Oh, I heard something. Yeah, the, the door opened. Alright. Observe. Oh. Okay, I guess they were just taken. Yes. All right then. Paycheck. All right. A profit. It was really fucking fortunate that apparatus spawned like right next to the entrance. Come to on. To be completely honest. There we go. All right. Okay. So before, actually, before we leave, let us use some of our profits to secure some necessary equipment. Multiple times until someone shows up. Just like in real life, yes, Blue Griffin. That actually sounds very accurate. I'm gonna go get a drink. I'll be B since we're on the show. Okay. Okay, so... Where did Stella go? Ah! Did we leave just yet? There's still more stuff. Oh, yes, okay. That would be very useful. So, walkie-talkie, very important. And yes. Also, pretty intuitive. So, first off, to use the walkie-talkie, you equip the walkie-talkie. You press Q to turn on the walkie-talkie. All right. You, you hold left click to speak into the walkie-talkie. Okay, the controls are so finicky here. Oh, there we go. Test, test. Turn it on. Oh. Test, test. Roger. Cool. Okay. This also includes uh, the addition of batteries that we now have to manage. So, All right. up on the little guy in the top left, just above that, you should see a little battery symbol and a meter. 
and that shows you how much battery you have. Uh, if you need to recharge your battery, you come over to this part of the ship that has this funky looking coil on it, and you just hold E, and it huh. charges it. Interesting. So the flashlights will last for like roughly five minutes, so like half the day about. All right. Whereas the walkie-talkie basically lasts the entire day. For the most part, you don't need to worry about it. Just, uh, yeah. And then you can turn it off to save battery while you're flying in between planets and whatnot. <laughs> and uh, there's also a flashlight on the ground over there, so grab that too. Yeah, I think that would be very important. Okay, so you use the scroller to change different items. That's fine. So, we have met our profit margins, which means now we will be assigned a new one. Cool. All right. Quota reached. New profit, 254. Okay, yeah, we can do that. as we did last time. Alright. Let's get the fuck moving. Alright, this time we're gonna go use a different entrance. 8.02 a.m. once again. And there he goes. So in order to uh, access this next entrance, we need to do a little bit of parkour. Alright. God damn it. Get up the ladder. Jesus, you're like that little fox kid from Tanglewood. Except you're refusing to cooperate. Alright, now I'm back online. Okay. 1028. So last I heard, Sol is in the facility. I gotta get back up the ladder. I have secured our first bit of problem. <sighs> okay, are we back up for real this time? It's 139. If he keeps doing this, I'm just going to have to call it an early night. Because that's annoying. There. Over 30 seconds. So, that's progress. Slope. 3 p.m. Doesn't look like we have too much time. Correct. Thanks, OBS. Are we back? Yeah. Good. Now, OBS, please stay the fuck connected. And in we go. Obviously, verbally saying it to the software will not do shit. There is a metal sheet there, grab it. Oh, wait. A metal sheet? Yeah, it's right in the entrance. Scan around, you'll find it. Ah, found it. I have also found a metal sheet. All right, then. Oh, oh, come up here, come up here. Wait. Okay, yeah, let's get up. 
Well, oh, Chad. It's way later than I thought it was. Okay, um. Back to the ship. Be very quiet on your way back. There might be, uh, unsavory things that can hear us. Okay. You can also crouch to avoid making noise. What button do you push? Control. Alright. Okay. The ship looks clear so far. So how do you drop things? Just uh, G. Oh, G. All right. And we'll definitely have to close things off. But we did find the jackpot, so we can definitely get that uh, come the next morning. Oh, no, the loot in there resets every time you go up. Oh, fuck. I guess maybe it's next time. It's not that big of a deal. I guess maybe next time, whenever we find something more important, we'll have to, like, make a compromise to drop certain objects. Yeah. Because we can't hoard too much. We need a flashlight to see, and we need walkies to know where we're going. Will there be, like, some kind of feature in the future that allows to have, like, a bigger inventory? Uh, I don't know. Part right. of the game is learning to manage your inventory and take whatever risk that you deem necessary in order to secure the profit. Because right now it's not too big, but later on the profit will get ridiculous. I've seen it go up to like four digits. So you gotta start doing like a bunch of crazy stuff to start getting profit. You gotta start going to more dangerous moons, making like bigger risk loot runs, all kinds of crap. Also, we're about to have an eclipse, so we shouldn't stay out for too long. Oh, fuck, this moon is eclipsed. Oh, shit, I didn't even fucking realize. I got the notification. I wasn't sure. I didn't, I, I, I didn't fucking wait for the days to roll over before I selected this moon. Son of a bitch. All right, we got to fucking go now. Back to the shit. All right, literally find, like, Two things and then get the fuck out of here. Alright. Uh, there's nothing back here. Jesus Christ, I didn't fucking realize this place is a clip. Yeah, I should pay attention to the ceilings too. Oh, God. So much mist. Okay, uh, you need to find a steam valve. No, there's it so much... In this... It should be close by somewhere. Watch yeah. your step, though. Landmines? Just being a fucking asshole place. Yeah, I can barely yeah. see shit with all this, like, fog in the way. Oh, you know what? I bet you it's in here somewhere. Yeah. Alright, I found it, I think. Yep. Alright. Here we go. Okay, the steam cleared. Okay. So, if you find this little red valve in here, uh -huh. that's the steam valve, you turn that and it'll clear up the steam. Alright, fair enough. Oh, that's a key. Huh. What? Alright. Uh, well. this is dead end. Alright. On 
honestly, with what we secured yesterday, we might be able to avoid uh, taking too much time here today. All right. Maybe. Um, there's nothing back there. What about back here? Or is this also a dead end? Yeah, it is. All right. So let's try here. What's up here? That's also, wow, this place is nothing but fucking dead ends. Yeah, it's a dead end up here too. Okay, yeah, um, I'm gonna check over here real quick. All right. I'm guessing we were already over there. There's a key there. Uh, I don't even know what's down there, nor am I gonna find out. Uh, dead end down here. Okay, yeah, let's just get the fuck out of here. I don't see a lot of loot, and things are gonna start spawning soon, and they've already spawned outside. Oh, fun. Alright, when we get outside, be quiet, because they're definitely around now. Alright. And also crouch. Day and we only have a day left to fucking do it. Wow, all right. Well, chat, you uh, apparently missed the thing where we got eaten alive by a worm. Wow, okay, all of these suck, but the one that sucks less is this one. The thing that threw us off is that we literally saw like a creature. I'm like, oh, I better stay quiet. And then all of a sudden the ground was shaking, then we got swallowed alive. So uh, all the modifiers for the other planets are uh, shitty. Welcome to Val. This one is stormy. There's lightning. Oh, okay. But everything else was like. Uh, he went a little too far. Wait, did we run out of walkies? I see a bridge here. Maybe I'm supposed to go up there. Yeah, I don't like to. Is that lightning or is that something else? Where the hell did solar go? Maybe I should get back to the ship and try to find the walkie. I could have sworn I'm like, I thought it was a quick up. Oh god, I don't like the sound of that. I'm also trying to be very careful not to slip and fall. Because yes, there is fall damage. There was something alive there. Where the hell is it? Why do I get lost so easily? This is getting ridiculous. Oh shit, there it is. No, that's not it. Light switch. We literally don't have walkies, do we? Oh shit. I hope solar's okay.
shit. With OBS restarting so many times, I can't, I don't even know how long I've been streaming for. Supposedly speaking. Given the amount of times I have to disconnect and reconnect and disconnect and reconnect. I don't know what OBS's problem is. Okay, it's already noon. I can't find solar anywhere. I don't think I want to be around that. Okay, so while I have a chance, uh, thank you for sticking around as long as you can. I don't know what OBS's problem is. Um, I'm just going to call this one an early night and maybe try to leave the company either tomorrow or a different day when I have the night to myself. So I'll try to see what I can do to try to, you know, give you guys better entertainment than this technical bullshit. So you guys have a good night.